Welcome back to Panasonic Live at ISE. I've just found something on the booth that I think you're going to love. Frankly, I've not seen anything like this before, uh, and, and it's really, really cool. I'm joined by Ian Woosley, who's part of our development team uh, here at Panasonic. Ian, tell us what we've got. Sure, this is a new O2O service from Panasonic that we're calling Light ID. Uh, basically, we've developed a way to emit unique codes in light, in LED light sources such as displays, uh, LED lighting, and these kinds of things. And then we've also developed an application here uh, that we use to decode that light and then link to content associated with the content on the screen. Okay, right. can you show us a demo? Sure, so it's a multilingual app. Uh, there's four languages available here. I'm going to choose English. And then I just hold it up to the light, and it's uh, downloading content associated with that. Wow, content. so it automatically changes. Yep. And I can go to between two different light sources here, and you'll see it's reading those codes differently and downloading the content. It's amazing. Uh, tell us how is this different to a QR code, say? Well, with a QR code, it takes a, a lot longer. You need to find the QR code. You need to put, uh, go up to it, get it between the, 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 the square of, you know, of your camera on the phone, and then you download the information that way. With here, uh, we're simply, look how far back we're standing here, yeah. right? It takes 0 0.3 seconds to work, the light ID function, and we're just it's amazing. intuitively holding it up to the light. It's amazing, it's amazing. Where, where do you see these things being popular? We're getting a lot of interest at the moment from museums and art galleries, from theme parks, um, various different retail customers, QSR, all of these things, and the use case it depends on each one. It can be additional education information. It can be to enable new revenue streams for online ordering, for example. Um, or it can be high-impact, you know, event-based uh, things as well. Ian, I think it's great. Thank you for joining us on Panasonic Thank Live you. at IC. Don't forget, if you're coming down to the booth this week, we're in Hall 1, H20.